Hi and good evening to Professor Awangku Hassan Al Bahar bin Pengiran Bakul and to all my fellow friends. Okay, so today I will present my video presentation of individual assignment Business Ethics BT 21503. Okay, so in this case I will present about the review and critique entitled Ethical Practice Disclosure of Malaysian Public Listed Companies. Okay, so for the part of introduction is this article was published on 18 August 2019. So it have 34 pages all of it. So these themes, yes, of course have. So it includes corporate ethical values, action to promote ethics, whistle blowing policy, code of ethics, sustainability practices, and ethics comment. So yes, of course, this paper motivated to explore the level of ethical practices revealed inside Malaysia's publicly listed corporation because unethical behaviors are still occurring in the corporate environment in Malaysia. Okay, so for the review of the content of this article is the data set. Okay, so the data set includes 223 companies, which means 1,115 companies from 12 different sectors in the main market of Bursa Malaysia rosters. Okay, so of course, the original ethical commitment dimension tool was created by Choi and Jung and is shown in table 2. So table 3 displays the modified extended interpretation of the ECI which was modified by adding 9 redundant and particulars and grouping all the particulars into 6 teams to give the final 20 redeemers demanded to calculate the ECI stock. Okay, so for the 5 times of complete, compliance, uh, figure 1 shows the position of ethical commitment exposures grounded and the proportion of companies telling each item from ECI 2012 to 2000. Okay, so of course, figure 2 displays the position of each of the ECI teams. So the trend, the trend in the fresh accoutrements contains a list of sample companies, their ZT sectors, a double score for each item, and the overall ECI scores for each company. As we can see, in this article is from 2012 to 2016, 1,115 companies from 5 times of complaints were included in the data set okay so ECI in table 2 was expanded with nine freshers and fresh particulars and added up into team table 3 as there is no standard measure so commerce ethics values and gospel CEV conduct to promote ethics and help unethical gesture SCT still blowing policies WBP the code of ethics code sustainability practices trust and the ethics commission ETH are some of the team the extended ECI. So guys, due to the nature of the information gathered from each ECI item, which covers six ethics disclosure themes, binary scoring was chosen. Okay, so what I can critique about this article is these conflicts are occasionally very dangerous because more indispensable result to the problem may violate a specific law. So both individualities and businesses can be drawn into these conflicts because any of their conditioning may be called into question from an ethical viewpoint. So a moral theory known as a heritage of K implies that the absurdian rudiments of relationships and dependence in the mortal of moral meaning. So normatively, nursing ethics seeks to sustain connections by contextualizing and promoting on the well-being of caregivers and donors in network of social relations. Yes, of course, critics charge ethics of being a slave morality and ethics of care has brought operation to numerous moral issues and areas of ethics including animal and environmental care, bioethics, and more recently public policy. So there may be a set of ethical norms throughout the company. So many organizations have codes of ethics that may include general guidelines for doing the right thing for maintaining fair ethical behavior. Okay, so seriously, what I can critic more is uh, in this part is a code of ethics builds trust and credibility within an association and fosters a culture of open and honest communication. It includes honesty, integrity, fairness, and colorful other positive traits. So this is because unethical behavior has serious consequences for individualities and organizations. So we could lose our job and character, the association could lose credibility, overall moral and productivity could suffer, or the conduct could result in substantial 
for features of fiscal loss. So yes, I agree. Ethical issues are arise when a given decision, situation, or exertion conflicts with the moral principles of a society. So both individualities and business can be drawn into these conflicts because any of their conditioning may could be called into question from an ethical point. Last but not least, about the recommendation and conclusion. From a practical viewpoint, this study has some counter regulations for accounting regulators, standard setters, external adjudicators, perceptors, and listed companies in Malaysia. Eventually, we note that unborn exploration could concentrate on further holistic perspectives, including political, cultural, and economic perspective of countries, as well as behavioral perspective of associations exposing new practices. So, in fact, unethical behavior in the form of low position in consideration which includes rude behavior, condescending tone of speech, rough language, or a lack of regard for others, is now seen as having reached an extremely position in our society. Thus, therefore, ethics is a veritably complex field. But anyhow, ethical behavior is about decision timber, making opinions grounded on moral values and principle of right and wrong. So that's all from me. Thank you.